Okay, welcome back. I know I've been a bit of an absentee father recently. Um, I've had an awful hard time uh, finding time to squeeze in a little bit of a little bit of let's play, a little bit of video recording. But here I am, nonetheless. I'm here. I'm back at it, back at the grind, so to speak. Um, yeah, I've got got Pokemon to play. Gonna squeeze the last few drops of juice out of my Let's Play a gland, and we'll uh, we'll see where this takes us. And that was a horrifying image, and I'm sorry about it. <laughs> hey, what you got for me, useless? What you got for me? An X attack? Thanks. That's fucking useless. I'm definitely never going to use that. But thanks anyway. <laughs> Vaporeon's got 69 HP. <laughs> oh, epic. Um, I guess we'll just keep keep exploring. I guess I guess that's what we're going to do. Uh, we came down here last time, right? And I decided not to go this direction because of reasons um, I'm exploring at the moment. Let's go in here. Let's go. Can I not go in here? It doesn't appear to open from this side. Oh, so a one-way door, you know, one of those classic one-way doors that definitely exist everywhere. Um, I guess, I'm, guess I'll take this elevator and see where, where we end up. See what mysteries await. It's another scientist. Of course it's another scientist. When are they finally going to get that guy to spill the beans about the purification research? He might be the authority on purification, but if he won't talk, the work's not going anywhere. Wah! What are you doing here? <laughs> you just can't you just can't hear that noise anymore, can you? Like a few years ago before like the whole Waluigi getting in Smash thing that never happened. Um Wow was a perfectly acceptable bit of text to appear, but now now it's ruined, it's over. Wah is cancelled. <laughs> <laughs> This, is, this guy's got a pretty cool team. I, I like Anna Rhythm Lilip li Lilip, I don't even know how to pronounce that. But uh, they're, 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 they're cool, they're neat. Um, I want them, but unfortunately I can't have them because they are not shadow type pocket monsters. What I can do is I can dig at them though, and that's what I'm gonna do. Right here and now, on WWE Smackdown. I don't know if I've mentioned, oh fuck, that didn't do. It's, it's grass rock, isn't it? What am I doing? I'm a fucking retard. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know if I've mentioned this before, but I have. I've been really reindulging in in classic uh, WWF attitude wrestling entertainment recently. I, I I can't help myself. Like I know I get it. I get it. It's fake. That's the the usual criticism to levy against it. But it's just so much fun. It's just genuinely fun watching those big sweaty men kick the shit out of each other. It's it's so entertaining. It's like I'm I'm. I'm still doing a lot of uh, university coursework and stuff, I've got another two weeks left of that before I finally graduate and can be done with the whole education bullshit. Um, but thankfully I have two monitors, so I've normally got a wrestling match on the second one while I work. <laughs> and god, god damn, god damn, they're just, they're just so entertaining, there's so many fucking like, run, like everyone remembers, you know, your, your, your Stone Colds and your Rocks and your Triple H's and even like your Hardy Boys and all that sort of shit. But there were so many like obscure like nobodies in that era who just had like the weirdest fucking gimmicks and stuff like the fucking Godfather and Gangrel and people like that. Like every single fucking match was just entertaining in an offensively. It was just offensively entertaining is what I'm trying to get at here. That's what I was trying to spit forth from my succulent lips. It was it was odd, oddly satisfying to just to just revel in the ludicrousy of it all. It was just fucking brilliant. I can't watch wrestling anymore. The modern stuff is like far too serious. I, I liked it when it was really campy and did the Anorith just flex its vagina around me? I want it- I want it to attack again because I saw something and I'm not- I'm not sure if I imagined it or if it was real. Uh, if, if Vaporeon attacks, he's just gonna fucking kill it. I'll have Layer attack after the Anorith because he's slower than it. And Vaporeon can just sand attack it. I want, I want to see this again. Hope he does the same move. Yep, there it is. There it is. We all saw it. We all saw it. <laughs> 
<laughs> the Anorith has its own little meat pocket down there. I did not know that was part of the approved design. I was not familiar with that. The whole uh, hoot hoot having two legs thing from last episode was a bit mind blowing, but that is a whole new level. What, what, why, why does it have that? Why does it have an axe wound? Who, who put that there? All I want to do is work on my research. Don't disturb me, please. I didn't! I walked past and you got all aggressive. It's nothing to do with me, but... Of course it rains people from the sky, wouldn't it? Why wouldn't it? You know, why wouldn't it? Oh, who's wandering around here? It's me, unsurprisingly. Cypher P on Nexa. I'm assuming no one's going to have anything I can catch for a while. Seeing as how I just got like six new Pokemon <laughs> off the off the Power Rangers upstairs, Shop it and Swin up, both very neat, very neat additions to my team potentially though, if I if I were allowed such things. Uh, dug, d dig, dug the Swin up, bite the Shop it. I think that's how we're going to play this. I think that's how this is going to go down. Yeah, there's the one shot. There's that tasty, tasty one shot that we're all looking for. That's what we dream of in the Pokemon world. You might not be familiar with, with such concepts if you're from Odesleuth. Do you, you really think I want Odesleuth? Piss off. You, may, you might not be familiar with, with, with concepts as, as high and mighty as, as aiming for one shots in the, uh, in the world of non-Pokemon players, but I myself, I've got big dreams. That's that Spinarex capturable. Interesting. Again, I'm not going to use it. I've got no desire to use a Spinarex. I have nothing against Spinarex particularly, but it's not exactly something I, I feel my team is massively lacking right now. I wasn't I wasn't going on Cerebi.com and going, oh, you know what would really round out my team right now? A Spinarex. That did slightly less damage than I was hoping. That did considerably less damage than I was hoping. Was that not super effective? Is ground not super effective against ice? I'm, I'm getting bad at this game. At one point I was like a fucking Pokemon encyclopedia, but now I'm, I'm, I'm having a struggle. Is it rock that's super effective against ice then? Is that how it goes? I, I really thought ground was. I really did. Uh, layers dying, which is a real issue for me, honestly. I have Leia bite the swine up. Probably swine up, isn't it? Like swine. You know how when you're a kid and you just sort of read things phonetically and then you just accept that as the accepted pronunciation like decades later and it's not until someone corrects you when you're 31 <laughs> and you look like a right fucking jackass because you can't speak like a normal human being. You know that feeling? Or is it just me? <laughs> oh, uh, I, I can't remember my type matchups. Is Water Gun going to be good against against Swinub? Yes, it is. Okay, cool. All right. I'm starting to understand this game now. Right, this bite hopefully won't fuck up the uh, the spinner act too hard. Yeah, that's good. That's capture range if I ever saw it. Well, that told me, didn't it? That put me right in my place. This is what it feels like to not be able to dodge anymore. Life is suffering. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and steal that now. If that's all the same to to whoever's watching this, if that's okay with you. I'm just gonna just gonna put this put this in my ball and move on with my life. And it can go straight to the PC and sit there forever, because I don't care. <laughs> probably should care. I should probably care more about purifying the hearts of my poor lost soul Pokemon, but I just don't really, unfortunately. Not top of my priority list right now. Right, layer 17 now. 
So since she's she's suffering a bit, we'll swap uh, Battletoy in. Try and get some of that that corrupted corruption down. What's it called? Shadow something? Shad shadow shadow badness. I think I've gone and picked the right route accidentally. Please, Professor Crane, when will you tell me about your purification study? I do so want to know. That will be... That will let me power up my XD001. I so made it myself. I so made it myself. Okay. Don't you think that will be fabulous? You've got to be joking. I would never cooperate with people like you. I read that as corporate for a second and my brain was very confused. Oh, but why? I so don't get it. Okay, this person so does a lot of things. It's a speech thing. Okay, I get it now. Why would you refuse an offer so wonderful as this? I don't care how often you repeat yourself. I have no intention of helping your shadow Pokemon plant. I'm not sure if it's the, the yellow ranger over there who's talking or the, the girl with the pink pigtails. I'm assuming it's the girl with the pink pigtails, but I don't actually know for certain. I mean, I know this is Crane, obviously, but the person he's talking to, I mean. Artificially slamming shut the hearts of Pokemon. It's inexcusable. Put a stop to it immediately. Ah, so that's why the shadow Pokemon have re-emerged, because these people are doing tricks. Okay. Oh, you. You are so mean and close-minded. You won't even try to understand how marvellous it is to help my XD001. Naps. Okay. So it, it was the, the, the woman talking. Naps is uh, her second in command, I guess. Yism. Sister Lovrina. This is all your fault. Professor Crane is oh so cross because you were so rude when you invited him here. Was Naps one of the ones who kidnapped him in the first place? I can't really remember. You can't be serious. Listen to the man already. He's been saying all along that he won't help our Shadow Pokemon plan. I can't hear you. The plan is perfect. XD001's condition was off by just a little tiny bit. Being off by just a little tiny bit is enough to make it drop a ship. Oh, XD001 is the... the was it a Lugia? It was a Lugia, right? In the opening cutscene. And would you look at the uproar? Naps. It's so all your fault what happened every tiny little bit, so you so do something about it. I hate this girl's speech, it's just so confusing to my brain. <laughs> I can't easily compute what it is she's trying to articulate most of the time. Naps, was it? You have my sympathy. What a nightmare it must be to have someone like her as your boss. You put a lid on it, when it comes right down to it, it's so all your fault. He's doing it now! Come on, help us with XD001. Is that why it's called XD Gale of Darkness? First, we need to talk. I'll teach you why it's such a bad mistake to create Shadow Pokemon. Is he gonna like sway naps to our side and we're gonna have a, a cool dude on our team? That'll be that'll be awesome. Did you come here knowing that this is Cypher's lab? No, I just, I just stormed in, fought all these Cypher peons and had absolutely no purpose to be here. Obviously, it doesn't matter now, since now that you're here, we're not about to let you go free. Alright, Cypher Peon Solox. I feel like normal Pokemon games, they have slightly more normal names. Some genuinely bizarre just strings of letters being used for, for, for character names in this game. It's really odd. Uh, probably take the Voltorb down first since it's the biggest threat to my team. Hope this is enough. It's gonna outspeed because it's a fucking Voltorb, but it's fine. It's not doing anything useful. Charge before charge was actually an okay move. might have a problem on our hands next turn though. Now that it has charged, it is possibly capable of one-shotting Vaporeon. We'll have to see what, what big electric move it pulls out of its arse. Should be able to kill it with Baltoy now though, so I, I'm free to one-shot the routes with Bite. Oh, it's only Sonic Boom. The charge did literally nothing and it missed anyway. <laughs> Advanced AI on these these trainers, I'll tell you, I'll tell you that for nothing. Bargain! 
Bagon. B Bagon. See, I've never. Well, I say I've never. I I watched the original Pokemon anime, the, the original series back in the day, but I didn't continue watching it past like you know the original series, like past like Ash. I think I was like Ash went to the Orange Islands or whatever, and I sort of I checked out somewhere during that. So. uh... I actually have never heard like the official pronunciation of a lot of a lot of Pokemon names. Shit, actually. No, we'll call the bag Bagon 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 first. Begone, Bagon! <laughs> I know we can catch the new more. I was gonna water gun it because I didn't realise that at first, but that will be a one shot, so I need to be a bit smarter about these things. Shadow Blitz Numel. That's the new meta right there. Super effective. I, I'm genuinely confused. It, Shadow must be its own type then, right? And it must be super effective against water. That's that's the only thing I can take from this. It can't, it can't be based off the Pokemon's own type, because Numel is not a type that would be super effective against Vaporeon. Believe me, I may not know everything about these games anymore, but I know enough to know that. Okay, we're gonna need another bite. Another bite and we'll be good to catch. Hoping this will finish the... the... But no, I've got no other silly ways of pronouncing that. I don't know how it's pronounced. I guess I never will. It's not very effective against Bowtor. Very interesting. Very curious. Um, I guess I'll just fucking throw a ball. <laughs> I can buy these now, right? So it's not like I've got a limited amount anymore. If I catch it, great. If not, I'll buy it and then throw another one. so anticlimactic, like, you didn't get the little click and jingle or whatever when you catch things in this, it just immediately cuts away after the third shake. Feels like we don't actually find out the outcome. It's like when a particularly nasty chair shot happens on a woman and you, they have to cut away in, in wrestling. Yeah, these references are just going to keep coming. <laughs> it's just going to keep coming, it's not going to stop anytime soon. I'm going to start talking about D'Lo Brown soon. You don't want to hear me talk about D'Lo Brown and how he was so criminally underrated and deserved a world title shot back in 1998. Or 99. Whenever it was he was big. I don't know. I'm no expert on wrestling either. I do enjoy it though. I'm just gonna real quick, real quick pussy out for a second. Mostly because I want to know what was down the other route, because this is quite clearly the intended direction. This is quite clearly where we're supposed to be going. And if there's one thing I hate, being driven in a direction by a video game. I hate being told what to do. I'm in charge of my own destiny, god damn it. And I will, uh... I will watch the game crash, is what I'll do. Isn't that re really something right there? Isn't that re really something? It's the problem with emulation, ladies and gentlemen. Don't, uh... Don't cheat Nintendo out of their money, and uh, you'll be you'll be just fine in future. Anyway, rewinding this. Okay, welcome back. Um, the game, yeah, it crashed. There was no way of recovering it, so I've just had to play through that previous section again. I've just beat the trainer who stopped us in the corridor there previously, and now I'm going to save because <laughs> it was a pretty bad time for me last time. Uh, it's been a pretty bad time for me this time, honestly. If you take a look at my Pokemon, right? <laughs> the fucking Numel, the Shadow Numel, just completely swept me. Just, just took out Leia and nearly took Vaporeon down as well. It was a pretty bad time for everyone involved. Uh, that's my X attack from Useless. Gotta make sure I grab that. And uh, I'm gonna try once more to head back up to the Poke Center. I don't know if the game's gonna let me this time, but at least I saved. So if not, we'll just pop some items and keep going and pray things work out. 
because um, blind optimism is really all we have at this point, <laughs> both in this game and in the real world. <laughs> come on now, come on, let me up. Work with me, baby, work with me. Yes, excellent, good. This does, of course, mean that it wasn't necessarily getting caught up on that one specific um, elevator ride, and crashing is just something we might have to accept can strike at any time. It will forever be looming over our heads like the skeletal grasp of the Grim Reaper. But, you know, I guess we're just going to live with that. We're just going to accept that as, as, as something that might happen. Uh, save regularly, I guess, and uh, hope the worst does not come to the worst. So can we go this way? We can go this way. So what was being guarded in this direction? Oh, oh, it's it's locked. Awesome. Okay, good. I'm, I'm glad I came all the way back just to check out a locked door. That feels like it wasn't even remotely a waste of time and, you know, tempting fate with the whole Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness wanting to crash and burn every uh, every few seconds. I might be slightly overstating it, it's crashed literally once, but you know, I, I'm nothing if not a drama queen. What lies this away then? Is this something on the wall? No, it's just, it's just scenery. Okay, cool. It's another elevator. Every time I get in one now, my asshole is just clenched beyond all belief. It's, it's literally grinding my cheeks into, into fine powder. Oh, look, another Poké Center. That's nice. But why? <laughs> Hold it if you want to pop open, pop open that chest, you'll have to beat me first. Oh, that's fine, dude. That's fine. You could have just been in the room, though. You didn't have to, like, lay a trap for me. Believe it or not, there's no, like, ambush mechanic in this video game, so anything that you do around that is, is honestly, like, a bit of a waste of both of our times, honestly. Honestly, I'm pretty certain that matchup has a camel toe, but it's probably best not to draw attention to it, especially after the Anorith incident. Uh, I think I'm going to... See if I can one-shot the Abra with my boy, my, my girl, Leia, and then hit the match off with the big water gun. I think that's my plan here. Why does it have Reflect? Why is that a thing it has? Abras are notorious for being a Pokemon that have literally no moves, so why does this one have moves? We ran into one before, right? And it was all like thunder punching and shit. I, I, I don't honestly know who decided all this was okay. I better be a one, it's not a one shot. It's not a one shot, it's probably going to light screen next. A Metarabra. <laughs> Someone took it straight from the... Shit, what's it called? Is it just called the Little Cup? It's not called the Little Cup. There's a name for it. The... the like, uh, competing with pre-evolved Pokemon. I can't, I can't remember what it's called, though. There is a sp this one's got Thunder Punch too! Is that just what Abras do these days? Do they just do they just carry a fucking boss move set for no reason? Do they just learn a load of really cool moves? As if the fact that they evolve into quite possibly one of the most powerful Pokemon of all time it wasn't enough for them. I really should be leveling or de-shadowing at least my other Pokemon rather than just sticking with these to every match. I really don't want to swap out fucking uh, my boy Vaporeon. I really don't want to have to do that because, uh, you know, he's pr pretty good. He's kind of carrying me. <laughs> you got you to gotta evenly distribute those levels, you know. Get your team feeling, feeling equal. Uh, would be a bit of a threat to Leia. The other thing is a Feebas, <laughs> um, which I'm not particularly worried about. <laughs> but I think I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring Baltoy in. I'm gonna bring Baltoy in, and I'm gonna water gun the Makahita because the other thing, as previously explained, is a Feebas. I'm kind of upset that none of these are capturable, honestly, but I suppose the uh, this trainer is completely optional, so maybe it would be a bit rude to, to make entire Pokemon missable, assuming you only get one shot at each Pokemon type, which 
seems likely considering how, how rare Shadow Pokemon are in this game. Oh fuck. That was a powerful maneuver right there. Hey, you little mud slap. Way to go, Baltoy. Way to go. I'm not gonna have you use it because, as we have discovered, uh, Shadow moves are super effective against water types. But um, it's good. It's good that you have mud slap because I like that move. It's a useful move. It's both offensive and defensive. It covers all your bases. You can feel like you're being you're being one of those super elite gamers who uh, who who use status effects and and stat changes and stuff while also just attacking things. It's great. Oh <gasps> yes, yes. This is what we wanted. This is what we've been waiting for. This is the dream right here. Check out that bad girl. It doesn't quite feel the same to call it a bad girl instead of a bad boy. That feels almost, almost like I'm insulting it. Leia's cool now, though. We have cool, cool guy Leia up in the team, and we got an ether. That really, really wasn't worth. <laughs> having to fight a, a match for, I thought it was going to be something really good in there after that, but I guess not. <laughs> I guess not, and that's okay. Alright. Uh, let's get... How about... Has Baltoy changed colour because he's in reverse mode, or because he's friendlier than the others now? I don't know what the colours mean. I do know that I got a great ball. That's a bit more like it, useless. You're really pulling your weight now. I'm actually gonna I'm gonna sub Vaporeon out for a bit. I'm gonna run with Leia and Baltoy. See if the team can exist w without Vaporeon carrying us. And yes, I am going to be compulsively saving now. That's just something you're gonna have to accept in this let's play. <laughs> it's just gonna be part of the experience. Just constant, just constant. Every time I take a step. Hello! Huh, if it isn't a tiny little intruder. That's kind of rude, but also not entirely wrong. However, your name is Crink, so I don't think you're in any position to be insulting literally anyone. Snorrent. Babooch. Yeah, don't fuck with this team. Look what I got. Oh, look, he's got Intimidate! I forgot about that! Intimidate is so good! All right. Um, I'm, I'm 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 genuinely really like grinning over the fact that that Leia evolved. I like my Tina. It's a good it's a good dog. It's a good dog. I love a good dog Pokemon. Me. I'm gonna go ahead and dig the snow run because I think that will be super effective. I think. I'm still not entirely sure on that, but I think. And I guess Baltoy will hit the bar boat hopefully super effectively with the uh, with Shadow Blitz. Let's see. Let's see how this plays. Yeah, that's what we like, that's what we like. See, we don't even need Vaporeon anymore. We got this whole dueling business down. It's not a duel, is it? It's a Pokemon battle. If I call it a duel, then I'm implying Yu-Gi-Oh. Oh yeah, Baltoy's in reverse mode. Let's, 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 let's call... Let's call Baltoy. Hey, Baltoy. <laughs> there we go. Come on, big numbers, big numbers. Yes! That's what we want, that's what we like. Absolutely destroying them. You hit the wrong target with water gun, everything's looking up. Everything is really looking up. Again, nothing to catch from this fight, which is a bit, a bit of a shame. Hey, Sybeam! Hey, look at that little Sybeam! Should we hit him with a little Sybeam? Why not? Why not? Why the fuck not? God, the animations! I keep going on about the animations in this game, I know, but they are so good. They are so detailed. Like, I was looking at Voltorb on the second pass through. It's literally a ball. Like, they could have... They could have been really fucking lazy with it, but they added so much, like... emoting to its eyebrows, it's like... 
they, they clearly put a lot of effort into every single animation in this game, and that's really cool. Like, I've been playing uh, Trials of Mana recently, which is a good game, don't get me wrong, but like the animations in that are so sloppy considering how enjoyable the, the rest of the game is. It's 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 honestly like it honestly makes me sad to see it, especially when you compare it to something like this, which is you know a nearly two decade old game, fifteen year old game certainly, which is just so fucking smooth. All the animations are so expressive. They're so they're so detailed. It's so good. Genuine joy to watch. Like uh, every attack, it's, it's it's crazy. I like the stanky like that we're getting from uh, from uh, M M M uh, McGill Layer as well. It's, it's pretty great. Okay, so I think a bite will deal with the Natu since it's weak to that, and I guess we'll hit the Ninkada with. Uh, Side beam good against. Mm, I, mm, fuck it, we'll go with the side beam. Why not? Let's see what happens. We'll relearn our types together, eh? God, that evolution has done her wonders. I'm telling you. Went for being a liability to an absolute powerhouse. Wait, oh man! Holy shit, that's large. <laughs> Holy shit! They like tried to keep actual sizes for this, because if so, that's super impressive, and I really want to see a Waylord. <laughs> Don't do that. My non-gendered bow toy is, is having a bad time right now. Uh, need to call it again, I suppose. Yo, bow toy. I haven't actually checked. Is it possible to call a a, a, a non-shadow Pokemon? What's that option turn into for non-shadow Pokemon? It's so large. It's so big. It's so fucking bow toy up. Might be where we switch. It out, honestly. I think maybe we've we put enough onto it, and I still didn't check what the alternative to call was. Uh, do we bring Mareep in? I don't know if Mareep's going to be a permanent fixture to the team, but just being an electric type probably makes it a good choice here. Can't hit to purify to make some extra Pokemon anyway, can it? backups just in case I feel like uh, changing things up a bit. See I really do love, like Ampharos was one of my favourite Pokemon as a kid, I, I fucking loved it, used it in like every playthrough from, from uh, you know, the day Gold and Silver came out. But because I've used it so much I'm kind of reluctant to use it now, you know, it's like one of those I've, I've kind of overdone it sort of things. I don't know. It'll probably be one of those things where I keep intending to replace it with something else, but never do, and it just ends up just inadvertently becoming a, a, a full member of the team. Because if so, then I've, I've got like a four-strong a four strong team now, right? I've got four permanent fixtures already. And I'm, I'm, I don't know how far through the game I am, actually. I was going to say I barely started the game, but, you know, it, uh, I don't actually know how long this is. It, uh, it could be over very soon, for all I know. I defeated Cypher Peon Mida though, which is pretty cool. How dare you, I mean really. I should remember to read that one's failure text, I, 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 I keep forgetting that for the most part. I am so fucking lost now. Item. It's another ether guarded by an a entire trainer. They really value their ethers. Okay, where did I come from? Definitely not been through there, so I guess I guess we'll see what's up with these scientists. Have you heard Prototype XD001's final adjustments are behind schedule at headquarters? If they can get Crane to give up details about his purification study, all XD001's problems should be solved in one fell swoop. I think so too, but he sounds quite obstinate and tight-lipped about the whole thing. I've heard Lovreen is getting incensed over this. What? 
kid in the lab. Hold still so we can catch it, kid. Is it going to be a two on one? Or is it going to be... Are we going to fight Elrock and then the other dude afterwards as well? Is it going to be a bit of a, a gauntlet type thing going down? I forgot to switch up my leads, which means I've still got Biotoy out front. And I'm going to have to swap him turn one because I don't want him getting... Getting K owned. That's fine though. That's fine. We'll be fine. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll bring in the Reap again. I'm switching the right Pokemon out here, right? No, I'm not I'm switching Leia out. Oh, that was almost a mistake. And I can still call Leia. That is what the other option is. I don't know what the purpose of that is, but I guess I'll find out eventually. If that why not doesn't counter me into oblivion. Why not shadow tag prevents Baltoy from switching out? Well now. I am in a pickle. I'll tell you what. I'm not one for using consumable items, but needs must. Ooh, it survived. If it's got counter, I'm going to be in real trouble now. I don't think I've ever used a Why Not. I don't know, like, how early they they come across the whole counter in, uh, what's the other one called? Magic Coat? Is that the one? Hoping this one doesn't have them yet, though. So I'll take that down. I guess I'll side beam the Swablu. I'd really have liked to get Mareep in for this because he'd, he'd fuck up a Swablu, but... Oh wow, this this really is a Mareep duel. I can swap now though, so... I think now would be the time. Especially since we've got a fever pitch bow toy over here. All ready for purification though, which is pretty cool. Next time we, uh, you know, are not in the middle of a not Team Rocket lab, I'll, uh, I'll get right on that. Uh, I guess I'll bite the Corsola and switch to Marie. Who annoyingly is also in reverse mode, so I don't know if I'm going to have to waste the turn calling it first. I mean, they can still attack, I suppose, can't they? It just means they've put themselves in confusion or whatever, which isn't a massive deal. I really wish they'd stop growling at me, though. Kind of adorable. Yeah, I'd watch that all day. Uh, right. Um, I'm trusting Marie to take down the Gorsler in one. I'm trusting it. It might be putting a lot of stock into uh, into a sheep, honestly. Generally, trusting a sheep with with any major task of any sort is probably a bad move. If it comes to that point, you've probably made some mistakes in life. Or you're Welsh. But... I, uh... I don't know. I think I think Mareep's got something. Got a little uh, je ne sais quoi, so to speak. I think he can pull this one off. Well, that's what I get for having faith in anyone ever. I'm gonna go back to being my usual cynical self in future never trusting anyone other than myself to get anything done. You bite that. You thundershock that. Match over. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it almost as much as Leia is. With her fucking... bouncing around 
I don't know, I was, I was going to compare it to a wrestler, but I couldn't think of one off the top of my head who is, moves that energetically. Let's say Rey Mysterio. Everyone loves Rey Mysterio, right? See, I don't know enough about, like, old school wrestling. Because I know Rey Mysterio is actually Rey Mysterio Jr. So is he like... Was the, was, uh, presumably there was a senior who was also a wrestler. Is that how that went? I, I honestly don't know. I, uh, aside from like Hulk Hogan and Randy Savage, I couldn't name any like 80s wrestlers. Ever. At all. That, that wasn't my era. I wasn't, I wasn't born. I was but a fetus. I was but a sperm. So I was uh, of no good to anyone back then. I'm busy. I'll let you go today. So go home without any fuss, okay? I'm not good at battling, but now's the time to be... Now's not the time to be telling you that. Okay, cool. That was very odd. Like, one guy's like, okay, you can go home without any fuss. And then the other guy's like, actually, I'm going to fight you. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, son. This ain't good. This ain't what I want to be dealing with right now. Fucking dust ox. See, the Wingull is obviously the bigger threat to Balto because it has super effective moves, but the Dust Ox is a Dust Ox, so I feel like we're going to have to focus that down first. The Wingull should be weak to Shadow Blitz, because it's a water type. Let's just press some buttons and see what happens, eh? I never said I had to be good at this. Just because I'm playing the game doesn't mean I have to I have to be the world's best Pokemon trainer, right? It's all about having that fighting spirit. It's all about having the heart. Having 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 the love of, of my Pokemon and the respect and the uh, the companionship we build through our through our journey together, you know. That's what the game's all about. And I believe I have that. Look at Bowto, look at that face. You know you know he has faith in me. Sorry, it has faith in me. Shouldn't misgender it. It was very rude of me, very inappropriate. I'm very sorry. I'm going to go ahead and uh, just, just, just bring Marie back in for this one, I think. <laughs> I think that's the safer bet right now. I have faith that Balto will become a, a very powerful and very constructive member of the team, eventually. But right now, he's, uh, he's lacking a bit in that oomph, you know? Doesn't quite bring to the table what, what the rest of the team do. Speaking of oomph, Leia's in a bad way. Leia's been royally oomphed. Might have to make another swap this turn. This is truly a, a battle for the ages, this one. Leia... Sub out for the Vaporeon. Mareep... Fuck that bird up. Holy shit, that did a lot of damage. Holy shit! I was not... I, 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 I guess... Electric types don't resist water. I learned something today. <laughs> something that I will indefinitely forget again before next time I play this game. But I, I learned it nonetheless. Briefly. Briefly it was in my mind. And it will stay there for probably about another 20 minutes. Come on, Mareep. You can't do this to me, boy. Girl. <laughs> it's not immediately evident what gender they are, right? It's a confusing time. Uh, right, Vaporeon. We need to kill the Dust Ox. That needs to just go away. And I guess I'll use another potion. I guess I'm going to be one of those guys who actually uses his consumable items. I guess that's me now. Oh! Oh, that's interesting. All right. In that case, I guess I will call Mareep. 
Hurry! I just noticed that calling them takes a big chunk off their, their spooky meter as well, so that's a really, really good thing to know. Take full advantage of, uh, of, of the call ability in future. Quillfish. Quillfish. Tell you what, if, you, if, you're, if, you're, if you're the sort of person who can remember that Quillfish exists, you know far too much about this game. <laughs> Not to call you out or anything, but... Quillfish. <laughs> and I really need to. I, I, I want to fuck the quillfish up, but I don't know if it'll be a one shot, and I need to. I need to be careful here. So there we go. I used the potion. I, di I did the potion. Look at me. Look at me being the, the sensible, respectable uh, Pokemon owner, Pokemon trainer. I look out for my pets and my my battle partners. Right, so another bite should finish that. Thundershock should at least fuck this up real nice. And then it was the home stretch. Shame the game didn't feel like throwing a shadow pineco at me, actually. Pineco, not pineco. As I'd, I'd quite like to use one of those. That'd be a fun one. I'd like to add one of those fellas to my my mighty mighty team, but such is life. I guess it's a no-go for now. Maybe we'll get one eventually, who knows. I don't even know if like... I don't know if all the Pokemon are capturable in this, or if it's just like a certain few. Like if I'm gonna have a, a, a smaller pool to pick from. I mean if that's the case, that's fine by me. I can, can put together a team that I like, I'm sure, but it's uh, be interesting to find out. I'll pretend that I never saw you scram already. Oh, oh so it can be purified. I found a great ball. Anything else to sing about? I don't think so. I don't think so. I think I think we're good here. Um, right. I need to remember where I came from and where I'm going at this point. Not been that way yet. I came from here. I have not been to the the lift down the bottom either. I'm gonna save real quick because once again still don't trust this game there we go now just real quickly hop up here and heal up because uh, taking a bit of a beating recently there we go we're good oh yeah I want to heal there's nothing I'd like better right now honestly well aside from getting to purify my bow toy but I guess that's gonna have to wait for now I can live with it. We'll finish up here first and then we'll go do a bit of a mass purification. Which sounds like some sort of cult ritual, but it's 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 really not. It's really not as sinister as it sounds. Hmm, this is no place for a child to be sightseeing. There's a place for a child to be battling. Morbid. <laughs> Morbid. I'll just say that name one more time just so that it, it registers fully in the old brain cells. Morbid. Morbid Orbit. Yeah, get intimidated, bitches. I'm trusting a bite to really do some damage here, and I guess a Shadow Blitz the Lotad. Easy win. Easy win. 100%. They're both dead. Okay, that one's not dead, and we already know the Lotad isn't, so, you know. Oh, that did more than I was expecting. Now, I guess Lotad is a, a fragile little creature, so it's to be expected. You think psychic moves are a wise option against my team? Ghost moves are, if you had a good one. Do you have to reverse mode? Is that really necessary? Of all the modes you could be in, Reverse is my least favourite. I'm going to go ahead and once more... 
bring Mareep off the bench. Get rid of that last little bit of... Uh, oh, it's already gone. There we go. Apparently just being subbed in is enough to, to, to cheer him up. Get him out of his emo phase. Well, I made the right choice though, look at that. Water type coming in against my electric type. Predictive that. I, I could smell a water type in the air. I, I had... Static. He's got. St I love static. It's so such an absolute asshole of an ability. It completely shuts physical attackers down. It's hilarious. It's also arse to fight. So you know, I mean, I guess I'd prefer it overall if it just didn't exist. But it's always nice to have on my team, you know. What's this going to do? Is it going to be enough? Not quite. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Nothing Leia can't handle. Another victorious jewel under my belt. One step closer to being a Pokemon Master. One more scientist that slapped themselves in the head. Letting a child in like this on challenge, what's wrong with Cypher Security? It's pretty shit. <laughs> Honestly, that's, that's what's wrong with it. It's just not very good. Um, there's not really anything here, is there? Oh, there's an item down there, okay. This dude was guarding literally nothing, though. He was, he was, he was only there to just... Be a bonus jewel for me, I suppose. Experience is experience at the end of the day, so I'm I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be angry about it. I'm gonna embrace it. I'm gonna enjoy my my free level ups. I'm gonna move on to the next zone. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to save and I'm going to stop playing. Thanks for watching today, and I am fucking done. Bye.